Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, don't forget to scroll down and subscribe. Um, so today's video is going to be much happier than the last video. It is a huge, huge makeup and beauty product haul. I have some stuff here from Morphe's Brushes and some stuff from Ulta and some items that I got for Christmas and just items that I picked up around the holidays. So we're actually going to start with the Morphe's Brush Package because I want to talk about the lipstick that I'm wearing. And I do have some swatches already on my arm and hand and everything because I did get the package and I kind of played around, so I'll go over all of that. But the color that I'm wearing today is called Unicorn Blood. And it just looks like that. And it's a really pretty, like, burgundy brick shade. Kind of almost matches my sweatshirt. So these colors are permanent colors. They come in the pink packaging with the stars on the front. And then as you guys know, I got a couple of the holiday shades, which came in the white packaging with the stars on the front. So that is the difference with those. And then the other two shades I got are Posh Spice in dominatrix and i'll show you on my hand that is unicorn blood posh spice and dominatrix dominatrix is like a nice chocolate color posh spice is like a really nude shade and i'll just take those out real quick so you guys can see from the bottle that is really extremely pretty so i can't wait to wear that one and then i can't wait to wear dominatrix and also try it on, out on my mom <laughs> who really wants um a nice chocolate liquid lipstick. So I'm going to be going pretty quickly through this video because I have a lot of stuff to get through. And it would be like an hour long if I didn't move quickly. So I have a small Morphe's palette here. And it is one that I put together. It is, first off, it has like a huge mirror. And then, as you can tell, like I did dip and swatch in them. But this palette, you can buy the individuals, and I'll show you one of the individuals because I got an extra one. And it just comes like that, and the color is on, the shade is on the back. This one's dazzling. So I'm actually going to put this in my 100 subscriber giveaway because I did get an extra one, so that is awesome. And you guys know I've been putting that together, and I'm so excited because I noticed the other day that I reached 100 subscribers. So thank you guys so much for your continued support. That's awesome, so I'm going to give back to you guys with that. And I'll have a video soon to show you guys everything you'll be getting. So I swatched this green shade right here, um, this mossy green, and this matte green. So the other two look like they're shimmers, but I'm going to swatch a couple of the other shades in here real quick, just so you guys can personally see the quality on camera, because I really don't have anything bad to say about the color payoff like it's extremely nice so we're gonna do those ones and as you can see like these metallic -y ones are kind of powdery but as i always say nothing you can't work with you just gotta really blend so those are right there and look how like extremely pigmented those are those are really nice and this pink one is a matte so i'm not just swatching the metallic shades because as you guys know the metallic shades are going to show up no matter what. Sometimes it's the matte shades that don't come out so nicely. So I wanted you guys to see that in this palette, everything's really nice. Um, <clears throat> the next palette that I have is the 35S palette. It comes boxed like this, which now I can get rid of the boxes. And it has bubble wrap around it, so it's packaged really nice for shipping purposes. It's just a hardback casing, and it says Morphe's on the front. And then it tells you the palette down here on the bottom, 35S. And I never keep the plastic topper on here because it just falls out. So take that off. It doesn't have a mirror in it. It's just a regular palette. And these are all the shades. This palette um, has shimmer and matte shades. So I will just swatch a couple from this palette as well. Um, we'll get this yellow. 
and we'll do this light bloom. So it just looks like that. Again, the color payoff is pretty good. The matte ones you do have to kind of work with a little bit, as you can see the yellow and that blue. But the color above it is really pretty. I mean, they're really pigmented, really pretty. They show up nicely. Like I said, you just you just got to work with them. But they're inexpensive palettes. I believe this palette cost me. I left the paper downstairs. Nineteen dollars, nineteen ninety nine. Um, I think both of them did. So that's really not bad for getting 35 shadows and at good quality. So the next palette that I got is the 35B palette. And this one is also matte and shimmers. And it is just full of extremely bright colors. This palette is going to be awesome for summertime. So we'll swatch a couple shades from here. And we'll do that pink shade. So those are, those colors are bright. Wow. I have to say that I am impressed with these shadows. Okay, so the green's right there. So I have tattoo. <laughs> and then we have the blue and the pink right there above it. And like I said, like, the color payoff is good in my opinion. I'm definitely not complaining with any of these shadows. So, worth the $19 in my opinion. Well, 20 bucks. And then the last thing I got from Morphe's Brushes is this nice brush belt set. And the brushes are really soft. You get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18 brushes. And this cost me $19.99. It is limited edition, but they do still have um, this green one. They have a pink one, and they have a purple one. And the brushes are just really, really soft, like you can see. So I'm excited to use them. Um, it'll definitely be good for someone who does makeup on uh, people a lot. At least you have a nice brush belt to wear with brushes that maybe you're not using. Okay, so that is the Morphe haul. I'm just going to go over the stuff that's in front of me because there's a ton. So for Christmas, my mm -hmm. husband bought me the e.l.f. palettes set, and it came in a box with four palettes. The palettes have names on them. The first one is called Nude, and so it has some really nice nude shades. There are four shades in each palette. The next one is called Drama, and this one is like dark shades for a night out. The next one is Bronze, and these are dark brown into light tan shades. And last but not least, this one's called Party. And so you have like two brighter colors and then two darker colors in there. And we all know how much I like my e.l.f. makeup. I'll put those up there. Um, so I feel like the quality of the shadows is really good. I've told you guys that. Um, the next thing that I got from my husband is the e.l.f. Uh, blush palette. And this one is in dark. And I really did want uh, this palette, so I was excited that I got it. It does have a nice big mirror down at the bottom, good for travel. And then it has four shades here, which I'll just quickly swatch those four shades. So we have like a couple light dark shades, but they're like red pinky tones. Ooh. Well, those are really, really, really pretty. So there's those right there. So I'm excited to try that out. I haven't played in that yet. There are some products that I have played in, and I'll go over those ones. I also got from my mom this nice hard candy palette, and it is called Raining Men. Really pretty shades. As you can see, the greens and the copper and gold. So you guys know I'll be excited to play around with this. It's really shimmery. So I'll definitely do a review on this palette. You guys know that I did a review on like the nude one before. 
So I'm excited to try that one out. Um, also, I got this hard candy um, palette from my husband, and I really, really, really wanted this palette because of the greens in there. It's just really pretty. Like, look at those colors right there. And I've also heard really good things about this palette. And it also only costs about $5. Um, I know that you can find it at Walmart. I think you can find Wet n Wild at Drug Mart and Target for sure. And then also I got this palette from my mom. It is a Perfusions palette. It's called Twinkle Twinkle. You guys know how much I love Perfusions makeup. Like, their eyeshadow is such good quality. Let's just, let's get our swatch on. So we'll do those three. And look at the payoff from that one already, just on my finger. Ooh. These are, like, nice, pretty, shimmery shadows. There are three right there in a row. So I will do a review on this palette. And then from my husband, I got L.A. Colors. Um, I got the blues into the greens. And you guys also know that I think L.A. Colors is really amazing as well. Um, I'll do a little bit of swatching from this one, too. So there's the color payoff on that. And these are so cheap. L.A. Colors, um, Perfusions. Like, seriously, I think that Perfusions palette costs, what, a dollar? Yeah, it cost a dollar. I don't know how much my husband paid for the um, L.A. Colors one, but just look at that. Really pigmented. So the payoff from that is also really nice. I mean, you guys wouldn't even be spending, spending hardly anything to get these eyeshadows. My daughter bought me this one. It is Color Mates, and you can find this at Big Lots. It was only a dollar, and look at the colors in there little bit of everything. So it's just a gorgeous. Really sad when your daughter knows how much you're in, into makeup and she buys you some for Christmas. So there's those three. Boy, I'm just going to be wearing blue, I think, every day in the summer because I have a lot of blue shades, which are, ooh, those are really pretty. So then there's those three right there. And as you can see, the color payoff is really nice from that as well. I got um, another Perfusions palette from my mom. It's the Neon Brights. You get 24 shadows in there. And then you guys know you get the um, black eyeliner and the little sponge brush that I don't use. So there's that one. I'm going to uh, probably do a tutorial with this one with, like, a first impressions and a review just, like, on this palette itself. So I'm not going to swatch it. It has plastic over it anyways. Um, something I've never tried that my husband bought me is these L.A. Colors blush. I've never tried um, blush from them. I've only tried shadows, and it's, looks, ooh, they look pretty, warm shades, and pretty pigmented, too, look at those, so, I'm pretty excited to try that, too, that'll be interesting for a look, I got another e.l.f. blush, so, I love e.l.f., I got an e.l.f. moisturizing lipstick in the shade Red Carpet, um, it's pretty. It's just, it's a light sheer. You gotta really build that up. But it's a really pretty red. And I love red lipstick. It could be matte. It could be shiny. It could be red lip gloss. I love red lipstick. So, I'm not, and we're not gonna go wrong in that department. Um, and then my sister got me this Glitz and Glam there are eyelashes, and you get two, four, six, eight, ten, and they're just a bunch of different, bu a bunch of different lashes. Um, I am excited to try them out, and I'm actually going to try and give them all a shot. I'm really picky about my eyelashes, but sometimes you never know if you like um, a different kind if you never try them out, and you can never have too many eyelashes, especially when you wear them every day like I do, because you don't have eyelashes. So, my mom and I have been doing a little bit of shopping. You know how after Christmas everything pretty much goes on sale and it's like darn near free. <laughs> the way I feel about it. So, I picked up a couple of things. I did have a Burlington gift card. So, I went there and I got this ult um, Ultimate Makeup Blender with a, a handle and it says Elite on there. I pretty much just got it for like baking my face. 
Um, I like the way that the brush is, the sponge is flat in the front. So it says hypoallergenic and latex free, and it was $4.99. And then something I'm excited to um, try out, I'm going to do a video for that with a for first impressions. I did do an impression on my mom last night. So if you follow me on Instagram or you follow me on Snapchat, then you've seen those pictures. And if you did not see those pictures, the links will be down below to follow me. So like head over there and check them out because this foundation on her face was amazing. It is the Maybelline Dream Velvet Soft Matte Hydrating Foundation. I got the shade Coconut. You guys know how I feel about the shade. It's usually pretty dark on me but I can make it work. But the shade up um, is caramel, and it's just way too light for me. Like, it worked on my mom like a dream, but you could just tell that I would be sitting around looking frosty, ashy. It just wouldn't work. So we're going to make this one work. But this is so smooth and so creamy. Like, I literally don't have a bad thing to say about this. And then you get this Dream Beauty Blender that you can buy separately that you're supposed to apply this with. I'm not a beauty blender person. I got this to blend in my concealer before I bake my face. Because you guys know I have like a raggedy <laughs> like little sponge blender that I've had for a long time. So I needed some new ones. So be on the lookout for that video. I also got the Insta Instant Age Rewind um, Treatment Maybelline Concealer, which we also tried on my mom last night. I will be doing a first impression on myself with that foundation, so I'll include the two in the video. My mom actually really likes this, and she's really picky about her concealer. She said it was, like, really smooth and creamy. Did it hide the fine, fine lines and dark circles? So it does what it said it was going to do. So I'm excited to try this because you guys know how much I love my concealer. Um, so my mom found these at Burlington, and I picked up both of them. Never heard of this brand. It is beautiful, is the brand. Um, oh, JB, just beautiful? Hmm. Okay, well, these are bronzers. But we use them as blush because if you watch my videos, you know I am not a bronze girl. I'm not going to bronze my face, my cheeks, or anything like that. So we're using these for blushes. And this one is called Autumn Bronze. Really pretty. This one we also put on my mom last night, and it is, like, a nice warm shade. Can you guys see that? Like, it just gives you that, like, shimmer. Let's see. You probably won't be able to see it on my skin. It is just really light. You can't see it right there. So it is very pretty, and it looked so good on her. I'm telling you guys, you guys need to go on my Instagram and just check out the pictures because everything looked really nice on her. And then I picked up a baked face blush from Measurable Difference. Which I've seen that. That beautiful um, bronze is also, it says buy them on the back of the box. This was $3.99. I got it in the shade Rose. I'm excited to try that color. I picked up from... Walmart, the Hard Candy Bold and Gorgeous High Drama Felt Tip Liner. It's for dramatic lines. It's black as black. My sister said that she's been using this, and she had a couple things to say about it, that you can't really, like, shake the ink down. So after a couple uses, she said that she felt like it dried out. And she said you also can't go back over the line, because if you do, it just kind of wipes off. Um, I am going to first impression it, but I'm pretty bummed that she told me that, because... I kind of already have it set that I'm like, probably not going to like it, which sucks. But we'll try it and we'll see. I'm also going to try out a new volumizing mascara. It's called Truly Yours from Rue 21, $3.99. I always say mascara is mascara, but I am trying because some of you guys do ask for really nice mascaras. Um, from Walmart, I picked up the Garnier Skin Active um, Cleansing Water. for It removes makeup. Oil and alcohol and fragr fragrance-free, and it's dermatologist-tested. My mom used it to clean her face last night. My sister used it to clean their, her face last night. They both said that it was pretty good, and I noticed, like, it feels, like, silky. So it's definitely not going to dry you out. Um, but you guys know I needed something new to take my makeup off with. And then lastly here, 
I got a Sleek Eye Divine palette. And I did order this off of eBay. Um, Sleek is from the UK. And I guess it was originally created for women of color. But it's come a long way. And the reason for that is because their eyeshadows are highly, highly pigmented. So, first time swatching on camera with you guys. Whoa. Wow. I'm already, like, over here impressed. It's hard to pick up that yellow with my nail. But those are really pretty. I will say that they are definitely powdery, so it's something that you have to work with. Let me get a little bit more of that yellow because it was, like, so hard to get it swatched. But they are bright, and they are pigmented. So I will be doing a video with this palette as well. First impressions, I paid $10 for this palette. But Sleek does have a website, and I did order some things from them. I just haven't gotten the order yet. So that is it for today's video. Like I said, I am getting some items together for the giveaway. So far, I have some lashes here. I have a little thing of glitter. And then I have the Morphe's shadow. So you guys be on the lookout for that as I get everything together. Um, like I said, if you're not subscribed, scroll down and make sure you hit the subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. And that's it. I'll see you guys next video. Take care. Bye.